you sent for me. Why? To unlock the secret key of world among all of us gathered here. Your father was built to sign before his demise. And since then, the progress of this brotherhood has been dormant waiting for your return. Welcome home, Nabike, the great son of his father. Sign the book and take your place in the gathering of men. you signing it. I see bloodshed. I see blood suckers. I see demons. Enough is enough. What nonsense is he talking about? Nabike, you owe your success to this noble gathering. Nabike, sign the book. We are waiting. And you will wait till eternity. What is he blabbing about? The divide is fast closing on all of us. You will face the wrath of Grandmaster if you refuse to sign the book. For many years this brotherhood has shed innocent blood. Wasted innocent lives. Caught short dreams. Destinies. I will not be part of it. Nabuike. There is no other signature aside you. This is the source of our livelihood. Sign the book and stop wasting our time. Any book? Who are you? Where is the queen? She's inside. We must see her now. Give me two minutes.
Hello, His Excellency. Good day, sir. Oh, I forgot. I'm so sorry. I will inform the party. It's all right. Do have a nice day. Thank you. Peter? Greetings, my queen. Mm. Some men are here to see you. Some men? Yes, my queen. Without names? They refuse to introduce themselves. The queen demands to know who you are before she can attend to you. falling apart here. Your father's business is suffering. His throne still remains vacant under threat. The kingdom is in chaos. I want you to take the next available flight back home. What again? The cabinet members are here to see you. Where are they? They are in the guest sitting room. Without notice? Cabinet members will be taking up. So what do I owe this visit? Has it got into this? Barging into this palace without prior notice. Your Majesty. Times are bad. Caution and courtesy no longer serves us well. Never in the history of this our land has the throne of our fathers been left bare for this long. Shouldn't be so. Well, my son, the heir operates to this kingdom just needed a few time to take care of things abroad. He's an entrepreneur. He's not lazy about. Excuse me. Remember you're talking to a royal majesty. I know. I know. Her majesty. There is no business in the whole world that is as important as ruling the people. We have been abandoned. Violated. Let bear. And in fact, exposed to danger by the negligence of the prince. Her Majesty, our patience has gotten to its elastic limit. Even the was here. More, please. A little more. He just assured me that he will be with us in no time. Just if it tarries more than we can bear, we will have no other choice than crowning the next person in line. Need I remind you, he is not the only qualified person. He is just an heir apparent. As you know, you see Karaka Nebogi. Let him tell us. 
ya agwa ye kai oto ru si akaraka that will rule us how can it we 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 have been left like atoro na we onye che atoro na we onye che eh ki we na we no we na we we na we what kind of thing is this her majesty has given us her words and the boys na oku ada ru ni we na ada zo Nigeria, my Lord, and Your Majesty, our people are worried. They stitch in time; they say saves nine. Then they go and go. Now, Lordachi, come back and read from Katani. We buy one book today. Oh. What to be so? I need him to make him wait. You should please calm down. In the case not in Abuja or Lagos, that he will just hop into an aeroplane or get into a car and start rushing home. He needs time to process his papers and documents. That's the point. He needs to be quick with it. His absence here is ruining things. I will call him. He's my husband. And I'll make sure he comes back home. I just called him. Mother, like I said, he's my husband. I'll make sure he comes back. That he hops on the next available plane back to Nigeria. Look, this man in question we're talking about is my brother. There is nothing on earth you will say to him that will wow him. Princess Amanda, I said I'll bring back my husband. And I'll do just that. I have a plan. Good this is my queen. My son will be arriving at the airport. Maybe in three or four hours. Time. I need you to go to the next. That's my queen. Are you there? Oh. Okay. Okay. Paulina? Ask your mother. Cleanliness. Orderliness and comportment. Yes, I want everything to be in a serene order here. Mm. And the food. You know what he likes? Yes, mother. Inform the kitchen. Mother, I will take care of his food. I will specially prepare something for him. Michi, mm, you know that you don't need to worry. I'll handle it. I'll be fine. Excuse fine. me. Be a mother. Assist her if she'll be needing help. Kiku mother.
my prince. Keep guard, and you do not know my itinerary. Are you drunk? Where are you now? My, my prince, the car just developed a fault. The, the car just developed a fault. And we're fixing it. Listen, there are a thousand and one things that make me upset. Lying to me is one of Sorry, sorry my prince, we'll be there soon. Get the mechanic, get the mechanic, get the mechanic. Get the mechanic, get the mechanic.
What's going on here? In fact, let me go and check. Take what? The place is waiting. I will already let. The place is waiting. Let's move.
a clear explanation of what your son just did. Hold your peace, Lelaka. My son is perfectly fine. Um, as an honest initial, I'm not Just some few minutes ago, he did not look it. He did not act it. Preempting. Sorry to disappoint you. Cabinet members of Ifite Kingdom, My son is a bit under the weather. It must be stress from the long flight under the short period. Are you making excuses for him? All of us left the comfort of our homes, came here to welcome him. He looked at us as a pile of shit and walked out of our presence without saying a single word. And you're there making excuses for him. I am trying to make you people understand the situation here. Huh? As none of you has ever been on a flight before. Huh? Well, you might not relate. A way your joke. The crown prince of Ifite Kingdom will speak to you when he is well rested. He just disembarked. You Excuse see? me. <laughs> uh, oh no. <laughs> no. You see? Oh no. Can you all see him? Hmm? Is this the man you want to rule this kingdom? Eh? I'm asking you. Oh no. Hmm. Uh, oh. Um, <laughs> uh, um, my people, please. I think we have to go home. We need to sit down and put heads together. Let's agree with the mother that we need rest. I don't think I'll do that. Sure, sir. Sure. I've been waiting for the report on that accident. I'm sorry, sir. I'll rush the bodies to the hospital. Good. I need an investigation on that express route. Well, I've gotten a whole lot of accidents. Do you suggest to mount roadblocks there, sir? Sweet bumps are better. I'll see to that. Good, get to work. Honey. I am fine. I just need some rest. I specially made this for you. I made it myself. And I know it's your favorite. Nice. Thank you. But you shouldn't be stressed, my boy. No point. Honey, what are you talking about? You're carrying my son. Oh, I love. Don't worry. I'll think about it, okay? All right. <laughs> it's okay.
Are you okay? Blood. Blood. Where? Uh, I saw blood earlier on. I know what I saw. Sir, excuse me. Hello, sweetheart. I'm downstairs. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm coming now. Um, um, Amanda, who are you for? Oh. I'll come and see this. Blood, blood where exactly? What is that about? What do you make us for? Do you know how long we have voted for your return? Exactly, Napige. This is unacceptable. You cannot continue to keep us waiting. You. I'll give you two minutes to leave this palace or you'll regret it for the rest of your lives. Oh no, you don't have to force him. He has refused ascending the throne of his fathers. So, you crown another. And that another is? Mwa. Oh no, Mwa. Me. You and I know well that I'm the next to ascend the throne of my fathers. Oh no, you are committing a royal crime by leaving the throne of my fathers empty. Oh no, you are putting this land to ridicule and danger. You have a capable hand that is willing to rule and lead his people. Oh no, why waste time? Oh no, crown me. Crown me, oh no. Uzi, you are right. But this is not a matter to be jumped into. If the prince was still abroad, I refused to come back. Then it will be a different story. But now he is here. Tell me. Oh no, tell me. What difference does it make? Oh no, what difference does it make when he has refused ascending that throne? Oh no, crown me. Crown me. Hey. Uzi, caution. I said, be careful. We need to find out what is happening to our prince. Our people say that if the rotten tooth is not pulled out, the mouth must continue to chew with caution. That is all I have for you. Oh no, I won't say so. I make a lot of you. How possible is it? Eh? Is it possible for one to see two persons in one person? Cletus. Papa. Cletus. Cletus. Papa. Cletus, are you seeing two persons in one person? Yes, Papa. And it's giving me great concern. Cletus. Papa. You say you see two persons in one person? Yes.
Um, the person you see might have mystic powers, or he or she is dead somewhere. Dead. Papa, Papa, I, 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 I don't understand. Uh, how possible is that? Eh? Is it even possible for a dead person to be dwelling among the living? How come? Uh, but don't know what the now. There has to be something strange surrounding it. Or you might have been symptoms of malaria. Otherwise, acute malaria can make one hallucinate. Papino's gonna track. Huh? Have you forgotten where I walk? Huh? Are you trying to say that uh, we cannot even uh, afford a uh, fleet to fleet our palace that we will be suffering from malaria? Huh? My only good people who are going to fleet in the palace. Papa, I'm strong. I'm very strong. I know what I'm talking about. Hello, Mama. I'm fine. Good morning. How are you? Mommy is fine, no. I'm doing fine. Um, Mama, let me call you back. Yes. the room from the exact spot you stood up from. There is blood there. There is blood everywhere. I don't know. Who this is, is it. I don't know. I'm serious. I'm not joking. Okay, come. Let me show you. Let it not be like I'm hallucinating. Come on, see. This is not the show you're cooking. I saw blood here. There was blood here. Immediately you stood up. I was there answering call. Then I turned and... I cannot see anything. I wasn't hallucinating. I know what I saw. I saw blood at this spot. Spot? There was blood. There was blood here. I'm not making it up. so that both of us will have an understanding. Understanding? Yes. In what way? Oh no. If you help me to ascend the throne of my fathers, I will offer you 200 acres of cocoa plantation and your generations will have that as an inheritance from you <laughs> what yes or no you know me as a man of his words 
on top of that i will send your children abroad on scholarship all tuition fees paid to the least by more <laughs> oh no i will pull down this house and build a befitting mansion for a kid maker. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> we have a king already. There is no way you can become the king of Ifide when the heir apparent to the throne is still alive. Together, we can effect the needed change to defeat the kingdom. I swore an oath to protect the customs and traditions of our people. Uzochuhu, Imalaso, Swanihwe, Imalaso, Swayanapata. Good afternoon, sir. M my name is Choma. Oh, no, who's that? Yes, sir. Oh, Choma. Why did you do this? Um, sir, I... I overheard your conversation with my father. And what did you hear? Your interest in becoming the next king of Ifite. And... Sir, I can convince my father to help you achieve your aim. Choma. Yes, sir. How do you intend to achieve that? Everyone knows your father to be a strict and straightforward person. Uh, uh, sir, you're right in what you said. But he's my father. I can convince him to crown new king. <laughs> For these sweet words of yours, I will transfer you a hundred thousand naira. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Choma. Yes, sir. If you achieve your promise, I will personally give you a cash of two million naira. <laughs> two million. On top of that, I will send you and your brother overseas for study. <laughs> Sir, as a matter of fact, you are the king already. Igwe. <laughs> Long live my king. 
long live my subject. <laughs> I overheard your discussion with that man earlier. How can you just let him go like that with all those juicy offers? Uh, you heard us. Yes, Papa. Good. If you heard clearly, he wanted the throne of Ifite. Then let me ask you, how possible could that be? How does he think he can just buy the, the crown of Ifite with money? Papa, that is the point. That is the point. Papa, money answered all things. Yes. Just give him the throne. Why your children enjoy the benefits that comes with it? Eh? But seriously, oh. Woman, Papa. shut up your mouth. Do you know the implication of what you just said? Papa, what implication did there? There is no implication. Do you think the throne of Ifita is a child's play? Look, let me tell you. I. Oh no, will be the last person to sell my dignity with just a few carrots dangled before me. Ah, Papa, bro, carrots. Yes, it's money. Ego. Papa, listen here, the throne, can I leave Ego? Will you shut up your mouth and Papa, get inside? Ni... Papa, we are talking about real cash, oh. I said, shut up! Nah, you can't leave Ego. You are the son. Let's enjoy money now. What is all this now? Papa, just give him the throne. Sweetheart, welcome. How's it day? Fine. And how are you, my wife? <sighs> well, your baby is kicking. That's good news. Your brother. I really don't understand him. 
He's been behaving strange. I'm worried. I thought I was the only one noticing that. What could be wrong? I don't know. You should know. You are the closest to him. I missed your company. I miss those days when we used to just sit out here, talk, laugh. <laughs> How you make me smile. I miss days you used to take me out on dates. And I can't wait to have them all over again. That is why you must enjoy it while it lasts. Hmm. Of course. I hope you're not planning on traveling again. Because you're not going anywhere. You have to stay back, become the king of your people, and together the two of us will rule the people of Ifite Kingdom. Hmm? Nothing lasts forever. People come and people go. Since you came back, you've been talking very strange. Is everything all right? How would you feel if you wake up one morning and realize that the person you love so much is no longer there with you? never see him again, to lay your head on his shoulders and have him by your side. I pray never to wake up from such slumber. And paraventure I do wake up, I will take my life. Do not say that. You must remain here, alive, to take care of our son and teach him to be a good man, better than his father. Honey. What? Why are you talking like this? Honey, what is going on? I mean, you, you scare me. You, you give me goosebumps. Is there something you're not telling me? Talk to me. It's time to go inside. Open.
confusion is too much. I am, in fact, every day I keep getting confused over what I see in the press. And no, no, I can't take it any longer, Papa. Don't confuse. Stop and take control of what you see. Papa, that is the problem. That is the problem. I cannot take control of the things I see. It's not possible. Hey, Papa. I, I, I will stay like this from morning to night. My eyes will be open so that I will, I, will, I will even try to see if I will see nothing. But yet I keep seeing them. I will close my eyes from night to morning again to see if I will just sleep. They will keep appearing as if they are doing replay. Papa, I even have to buy eyeglass and wear. You now look as if they brought those things I see and place them as an advert on my eyeglass. They will be playing like this. Even someone told me I should place, remove my eyes. I should put it inside a bowl of water. Nyacha, Papa. I did that. Do you know what happened? Afuwa manya. So tell me what I'm going to do. Then it's now time for you to talk. Huh? Yes, you have to talk. <laughs> Papa, put away by her drum. Eh? Papa, come on from there. Talk what? Wait, you want me to go the prince? It's not possible. Why? Papa, do you know what? Uh -huh. We move. That place is not a good place to protest. <laughs> eh? What are you saying? Papa, if I remove this my two bulbs, this my two eyes, these two eyes, now move up here and give you to see what I'm seeing. Papa, do you know what will happen? Ega fuanya. Ha, put up a Yes, Cletus. Cletus, that means you have the gift of vision. Say what you see. Because you have the gift of vision. And if you don't say it, you might anger the Spirit that gave you this gift. Please say what you see. Say what you see. Else you might anger them. And if they torture you, Cletus, if they ever torture you, you will die. So you mean all this has been happening? See, if I were you, I will not give up. Don't give up, because this is a big opportunity. I know. Of course I know. If you say the way I hurriedly met that man, at least to hear from the horse's mouth, I saw him with my two eyes, and he repeated exactly the same thing he told my father. So why would I even give up at all? When he said that to me. Choma, how do you plan on achieving this? Because time is no longer on your side. With the way I'm planning this, I will not leave any stone unturned. I will go around the clock and make sure he gets the throne irrespective of my father. And that is what I will do. I trust you. I trust you. <laughs> you know what I can do. But remember me. Remember me. I you will know. remember you this year. <laughs> I promise. If this whole thing works, you know you are my number one. But yes, I have to see you. Ah, are you chasing me out? No, it's not like I'm chasing you out. It's just that you are no sent for me. Why? To unlock the secret key of world among all of us gathered here. Your father was built to sign before his demise. And since then, the progress of this brotherhood has been dormant waiting for your return. Welcome home, Nabike, the great son of his father. Sign the book and take your place in the gathering of men.
this wrong? Why aren't you signing it? I see bloodshed. I see blood suckers. I see demons. Enough is enough. What nonsense is he talking about? Nabike, you owe your success to this noble gathering. Nabike, sign the book. We are waiting. And you will wait till eternity. What is he blabbing about? The divide is fast closing on all of us. You will face the wrath of Grandmaster if you refuse to sign the book. For many years this brotherhood has shed innocent blood. Wasted innocent lives. Caught short dreams. Destinies. I will not be part of it. Nabuike. There is no other signature aside you. This is the source of our livelihood. Sign the book and stop wasting our time. Sign any book. I cannot be the only one who thinks that there is something missing about Nabike. You're not alone, mother. I'm having nightmares too. All he does these days is ask after his baby. Can you believe that since my husband got back from America, he has not touched me? And when I try to touch my husband, he behaves as if I have, I have nails in my palms. I, I really don't understand. This is definitely not the Nabike that left here for America. What changed? What? I have tried to figure that out. I've tried because it's beginning to look like I am sharing a bed with a total stranger. I seriously don't understand. Sometimes he scares me. Cletus, hmm? how may we help you? Oh, the jello. There is fire on the mountain. Then speak. Madiala, uh, princess. My mother, also my mother, reality. See, the thing is that I, I don't, I don't know how to say this thing for me not to look stupid. Though I don't know how to shape my mouth for you to understand what I'm about to say. I don't even know how to express my feeling for you to understand my feeling. But the only truth is that the place is not good. What about the prince? I'll question him. Let me take through the bedroom. Honey, you're back. How was your day? Son, how are you? You're welcome. The cabinet members were here earlier asking to see you. On your mother. Has he lost his manners? 
It's time someone drums some sense into his head. Because he's becoming very disgusting. And his attitude irritating. Jeez. Let me, let me check on him. BK, what is troubling you? Since you returned, you've been acting strangely. What is going on? I've had so much on my mind. Enough not to notice you all. To the detriment of your family. Come on now. We all crave your attention. You're not being fair to us at all. You will not understand. Then make me understand. I need to be left alone. In a beginning. That's also at least with my head. A life. Ah. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. A life. No, to die here for nothing. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So I'll be eating three square meals in my father's house. I'm not working again. Nothing, 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 nothing. What do you know about me? Nothing, nothing. Yes, it's up to the fact that you are the next king of this kingdom. Nothing, please. No, I don't like so. Oh, fine, fine, fine. Just at times I see you with blood all over your body, <laughs> like a dead person. And at times I see you no more. I don't know if you are dead. Please, can I just go now? Just go, just go. I'm blue, we don't even come on salary again, please. I know this feeling. I know that something is not right with my brother. I can feel it. Amanda, you're scaring me. Are you really sure about what you're saying? You may be hallucinating. I know what I'm talking about. This can't be hallucination. Look, I know that something is wrong with my brother. 
But I can't actually place my hand on that thing. His ways, attitude, everything about him is strange. It's so unnatural to me. Then you must do something. What can I possibly do? I've been trying so hard to understand this low feeling that I'm having. Well, that is why you have a friend like me. I know things. I know places. She cannot imagine the wonders of this world. So here, yeah, this is what we will do. I am going to take you to a place. Where? Where we can find out all the answers. about the living dead in broad daylight that has been the way of the spiritual realm um wise one please i do not understand i'm here because i'm curious i want to know more about my brother and why i see the things i see i also want to know why he continues to delay his coronation Wise one, we depend on you. Listen to what I have to say. I will speak in the language you may not understand. A phantom in a body. To my words, the secrets of the all can never be revealed in broad daylight. Go home. So these are many the people have not learnt their lesson from challenging our kingdom. You seem not to understand. The courts have reached given their resolution. My father bribed the courts to get their resolution. Henceforth, the land belongs to Ameka Kingdom. Anyone from our place who encroaches on that land should be treated like a criminal. No, 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 my prince. We cannot possibly do that. You cannot possibly do that. Your father. I am not my father. My decree stands. Nadike has done the worst. He has done the worst. And we cannot take it. He has done the worst. Eh? Oh no, he has committed the worst sacrilege. The worst sacrilege. I said it. I said it. Nabike does not want this our kingdom to progress. Look at what is happening. Imagine. Eh? Oh no. For years, the courts granted us that land. Now in one day, the prince, the supposed Crown heir of our kingdom has destroyed everything. Everything. Hey, Mba. Oh, my man. Mba. My people. I still cannot find words. The whole thing seemed to me like a dream. My elders. So we've lost that land to America. When I told you people that weakling is not supposed to ascend the throne of my fathers, none of you believed me. Amen. Oh, but what? 
Nadike has reduced us to a laughing stock. If it is the giant of Ebiri Nabuo brought to her knees. Jay! Aro! Aro! How do you call if it is? Hmm. Well, my people. We have to swallow our pride and let go of the land. There is nothing we can do about it. Something can still be done. Oh no. My elders. We cannot just let go like that. If it's not in the nature of a future kingdom to let go. I have a solution to this quagmire. Go ahead. Tell us. We are all ears. Crown me king. Oh no. Let's look at this in two ways. As an Afia could be a law, but from the look of things, Nabike is not willing to take the kingship. Eh? A bed at hand is worth more than a thousand beds in the bush. Sometimes I sit and ask if he is really my son. What has he done this time? Or what he hasn't done yet? He is busy pulling all the structures down. Everything that makes us a first class royal family is being pulled down one after another. Destroying his father's legacy. That's bad. Are you asking a question you already know the answers to? Michi, you need to talk to your husband on time before we're left with nothing. But mother, what if he has reasons for his actions? I mean, what is a grown man what if he's trying to set up his own legacy? I mean, setting goals for himself. What goals? He is supposed to follow his father's footsteps. The father already made a table for him. All he needed is just to sit on the throne and reign. Easy. You're stressing yourself out. You shouldn't let these things bother you. Hmm? Stop worrying yourself. Okay, sit. Just sit. Stop worrying. I'll see what I can do. But first, do you need anything? Is there anything I can do for you? Yes. My son. I need my son back. I need my son. I need the Nabike that I gave birth to. Is it too much to ask for? Is it? It's not. I need my husband too. But we don't need to worry because we don't know why he's doing all this. Please. Why? Yohan Kadif, as we all know, time is no longer on our side. We have to do something. Nabike has long taken us for a ride and it has to stop. 
Yes, he's playing delayed tightest with us, with the aim of frustrating our oppressions. We need to take the bull by the horn and should be made to face the wrath of the law. You all should know that the slow movement of a tiger does not mean cowardice. Calm down. He must come back. For how long? To our own detriment? But, Grand Kadi, you all know we have been incurring a lot of losses in our businesses because of his delayed tactics. Are we going to wait for one year, two years, or three years? I suggest that we invoke the fifth order. Fifth order? It's like handing him a death sentence. The difference is that it is not a death sentence, but a little touch on his soul. I object to that. Quiet! What do you even know? Can't you see that things are getting out of hand? I'm no bad also. Abaya Jebe. Grand Kadif. I still move that the fifth order be invoked. Great one. He walked us out of his compound and threatened the brotherhood. The power to rule. The power to be loved. The power to be relevant and command respect from other kings will only come from this fraternity. Nabike can never ascend the throne of Ifite without signing the book. Great men of Azum is not a fair ground, but a school. Son of Ngokoye, grandson of Ngokolo, great grandson of Isika, appear. I can't get access to his soul. It is like a void. Baba says you have come to the right place. And here, all the questions you ask about your brother will be answered. Thank you, wise one. I assured my friend that this is the last Oscar. Baba says you're welcome. He seeks to know the name of your brother. What is the name of your brother? Nabuike. Hey! Ha! Nabuike? You call your goose in me? Motibokus or Mobala is a lawyer, say you call your call your simuli. Nabuke, Yaju, look at Yaju, son. Nabuke, I got lie, I got long. Oh, look, 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 Who shall let it shall let it like Jimmy? Let it go more to go, go, can I love a man? 
me ti ruru ohun ko sele be yiri shun be baba believes that what he sees is strange he has called up the dead and the living they all answered but he doesn't know what happened I, I, I don't understand. Kayi, Lati Momoti, Dogon Kene, Law Abame, Rushaleti Shaleri, Moti Bokus or Mobala Yesaro, Kayo Fakene. Sean Be. Baba says that ever since he inherited those gifts from his forefathers. He has never seen the kind of thing he sees now. This mirror has been with his family for over a thousand years. He has called your brother a countless time, but he refused to answer. Baba is confused. Uh, I, uh, I... Understand what's going on. Baba says that is the problem. No one knows if he is a human or a spirit. He is something in between. Fatum? Oh. Wise one, what do we do? We are desperate. Our people are groaning. My people are complaining. Nabike is destroying everything that makes Ifite a great kingdom. And you people are just watching. Eh? Ichi, unumjos ne nanya. Uh, who is it? You are right that there have been delays. But the elders are not to be blamed. Who else are to be blamed? Ichie, who else are to be blamed? You people are the custodians of our culture and tradition. And you must try to stand by it. Ichie, I think it's high time we took our destinies into our hands. How do you mean? Ichie, I need you to go. I need me, me, take. This is a sum of 1.5 million naira. Hey! If it's you. for you, convince the elders, most especially the stubborn Ono, hey, convince hey, them to crown me. Uzi is ready. Ichie, Adib ready. Uzi Choli Ichi Oboda, I want to ascend the throne of my fathers. Mm -hmm. Convince them. This is just preamble. More will come from where this one came. Uzi! Ichie. Nde bae na tuinu, wese na afu ife kubi. Elo ba. Hey! I will do my best. Trust me. Hey! Hey, go. Ichie. If I become the king of this land, unu ule mo obwa. Obema na abel. Ma to bagi ime go. Mm-mm. Ken furo na ya kamma. Uzi, consider it done. I must fight like a lion. Consider yourself as the next king of Ifite. <laughs> <laughs> Uzi, the Uzi. Hey! Odogu, Ichie. Odogu, Odogu, Kejemba. Ichie. Akwa Kekuru. Mabe is Uigwe. Hmm? Mabe is Uigwe. Uigwe. Mabe is Uigwe. Hey, Uzi. Mabe is Uigwe. Honesty.
integrity, humility, empathy, and selflessness. These are some of the qualities a good leader should have. Unfortunately, you have none of them. You have no business being king of Ifite Kingdom. Your continued struggle for the throne will be your biggest mistake. Do you mean? I, I don't understand what you just said. I no longer want to be the king of Ifite. Why? You, you, you almost. In fact, you're close to the to to, to the throne. Eh? Me kwa di ne throne. Oh, just say for small thing came on at the at the throne. Can I say? Why the sudden change of mind? Shoma, you won't understand. If it's a decision best known to me. Meanwhile, I thank you for all your efforts. I really appreciate you. We have to move on with our lives. Now. Just like that? Eh? Just like that, after Imago, the whole thing, he just give up. What the Kwanuma? You, 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 to do small small things like uh, buying drinks for the people, you know, giving them money, doing all things just for your kingship campaign. Only getting them small money, come Jiri Satulo. Choma. We we all spent money. Hey. You know how much I gave to you. Yes. Yes. I equally settled Ndiche. Yes, and you. so many other people. Yes, you. Therefore, see that as your little contribution. I mean, hey. your widow's might. Widow's might. But, but I borrowed that money. It made me a small girl. I borrowed it for the campaign. And you know the important that I paid them. Hey, my economy. Hey, with hope. Oh, with hope that he become more the king. Now that he got so I will settle these people. Yeah. I have to nye chupo no nye 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 natari ye gego ye nbi te ya naka Shoma Sa Igwe Take care Honorable Igwe Honorable Hey Ndere katase ku Honorable Hey Okwaburo Honorable Okwaburo Kletus what is it? You've been standing here for God knows how long Saying you want to say something yet you're not talking what is it? Uh, uh, Wadiala, you know we have been very close. Right from when we are small. We go to fresh water together. We talk to all the other together. Even we normally call our wambo together when we are small. So we share... Yes, let's just, just hold it there. That was then. Wow. So now look around you. And look at me. Look at me. Things have changed. Do you understand? No longer then. So respect yourself. Mm, sorry. Your Royal uh, 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 Highness. See, please. Before I say what I want to say to you, I want to, I want to beg for your pardon for my lapses in advance. Please, so that when I will begin to talk, if I'm begging for your pardon now, you should know that I'm going to use this pardon in advance. For my lapses, Biko. What is it? 
Okay. Please. I want to know. The prince. Does the prince. Your husband. Okay, in English, do you used to lie down on the same bed like the two of you? Are you mad? Are you insane? Alaboa Gogi? What sort of rubbish question is that? Are you mad? I'm asking you! That's that is why I used that English that I'm begging for my pardon in advance and this is the lapses I'm having now. Eh? But please, I beg you to answer me this question directly so that I can use the answer. It's very, very important. Please, I want to know. Not like I owe you any explanation or anything. I must not answer your question. You know that, right? Well, if you're asking for my enemies, tell them I sleep on the same bed with my husband. Make it sure, Naha, Hey, hey! Your Royal Highness. Be clear, sir. You approve thirty percent increase of staff salaries. Yes. Okay. And you also said that those who your father is owing, they should also come forward for their payment. Yes. Okay. Noted, sir. Thank you so much, sir, for your kind gesture. I know the entire staff will be glad to hear this. We also look forward to seeing you in the office, sir. I will not be coming. In a couple of days, I will leave. And I will be gone forever. So when you say you will be gone forever, I don't, I don't understand. What exactly do you mean by that?
What is all this? I am tired! I am done! Then what is going on? What is wrong with you? What is happening since you came back? I don't even recognize you. You don't touch me. I don't touch you. I can't even be with my husband. I am pregnant and yet you don't touch me. And you expect me to be okay with it. And you expect me to pretend like everything is fine. Well, everything is not fine. I am tired. I am tired. I sleep on this bed. Your mother was there. Your, your sister was there. And then you said... That... That is peaceful. It's the transition. The, 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 the transition that... Please, talk to me. What is going on? What is happening? What? I, I, I need explanation to so many things I don't understand. You step out of this room. I swear on my unborn child, I will make sure you come back here to meet our cops. I am not joking. Talk to me! Talk to me! I am your wife! I deserve to know what is going on! I am sorry. I know that since I got back, I have been different. A lot has happened. A lot is happening. But I ask for time. A little more time. Two days. And all your questions will be answered. serious. Well, I have never taken dreams too seriously. Like, they don't seem to appear real. This one is real. Very real. I mean, I was dreaming and I, I didn't even know I was dreaming because it was so real. And then, hearing my husband say those words gave me goosebumps. I, 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 I don't know, even when I think about the words, I, I still feel frightened. You see? Now you both are beginning to have the same unnatural feelings I have always had all this while. What do you mean? I have some weird feelings as Michelle. There is something strange about Inabike. 
I've been trying to find the answers to all the dotted lines, but to no avail. Queen Mother, we've been having the same dreams. The difference is I'm always in her place and she in my place. Like, I don't know, it's so confusing. I don't understand what is going on. <sighs> Why am I not saying it? Cletus. What about Cletus? Remember he always wanted to say something and then passes halfway. Don't you think there's something he's trying to tell us about Inabike? You could be right. His father. His father made mention of them coming from a bloodline of visionaries. What are we waiting for? Let's call him. Peter! Yep. Royat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've come raised. Uh, Mariana. Princess. Origine. Has he reached? Cletus. Ma. Is everything all right? Cletus, everything is fine. Hi! Hey. <laughs> Do you know when I just saw three of you standing like this? Me and Robbie mappled me. <laughs> but thank God though. Thank God. Cletus, I've come to see you. Ah, don't come inside my house! Excuse me? Sorry, Highness. Royalty. Royalty Highness, your Royal Highness. Cletus, no. so far we are very impressed on how you've been carrying out your duties diligently. So we think you deserve a pat on the back. <laughs> mention it. I should not say you shouldn't mention it. See, uh, eh, people, when they see me closing this gate and opening it, they think it's my work. Oh. When God decides to open you in this life, even your enemies will be surprised. See, in my family, we have this gift of opening gates. My grandfather, when he was alive, you were born in gate, you'll be impressed. <laughs> so it's the last thing. Just mention it. Thank you. <laughs> Ma? What do you like best? Pardon? What do I like best? Just mention it. And you'll get it within a twinkle of an eye. Let me see before. <laughs> Anything. Princess, are you in concurring to what? What could I do? Okay, ma. I I want two things. Mention it. First, is anything that can enter this mouth in agreement with the esophagus down to my stomach, then balance in my womb. Digestion. I'm okay. Secondly. <laughs> I need a wife. It really need a wife. My name Ganabe. I'm still hustling. Your Royal Majesty, see, 
de fruits du sous délicieux. Beautiful. Si le mettez, je ne peux pas dire que je n'ai pas ce genre de fruit. Merci. La personne qui a coupé ce fruit, c'est un bon cook. Le cook est un bon cook. Merci beaucoup. Cletus Could you please tell us what you have been meaning to say? Out of blue, you stop or maybe skip talking. What is it? Me? Yes, you. It's not hot. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I remember. <laughs> it's nothing. Yes. See, I, 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 I have nothing to say. I forgot it. Don't blame me. Yes, nothing very What do you mean you forgot it? You've been trying to talk to everyone in this house. All of a sudden, you've forgotten it. You can't remember. Are you okay? Of course. See, see, see let me tell you, people. I, <clears throat> I have short memory. Yes, what's wrong? We have given you what you want. Now it's your turn. Tell us exactly what you see. Hey, see, let me tell you people the truth. It's not my fault, though. It's this food that you people gave me. You know, I'm not the chicken. Ha! See, let's try something different. Maybe we can go for or, or for one. So that when I, I, I swallow it with mirror on inside, it can mirror out what I want to tell you people. It might be. Cletus, can you just be serious for once in your life? What is wrong with you? See, you people have to give me time. Let me just go and think. When I remember what I want to tell you people, I'll come and tell you people. Cletus? Go back to your post. You heard her. Leave. It's a lost case. A lost case. Maybe he's lying. I understand you have to stick to government instructions concerning the cops. Of course. Sorry, I have to call you back. It was the mug attendant. That. that man always gets on my nerves, trying to put words in my mouth. Sir, it says we have a breakthrough on the case of the accident. What is it? Samaritan brought this from the scene of the accident while he was clearing his land. You can see, it's the same. We don't need to waste more time. Proceed to electronic media. This picture needs to be on air. Add my number to that in case of any further contact. Okay, sir. Yeah, attendant. Sorry for breaking the transmission. See, you have to give us just two days, then you can proceed with the mass burial. Thank you. Just my parents. What do I owe the honor of your royal visit to my humble abode? I want you to be the next king of this kingdom. Me, the next king of this kingdom. But my prince, is, you know, it's highly possible. You are going to be the next king of this kingdom.
But you know, royalty does not run in our blood. I can't be king. It is not impossible. Nothing is impossible. You will hold on to the throne until my son comes of age. Your son? But you don't have a son, my prince. I have a son. My wife will give birth soon. Once my son comes of age, he will take over from you. You have nothing to worry about. Excuse me. You are talking of a successor here. Why you are still alive? This has never happened before. You will not understand. But in due time you will. You dreamt. Yes. The same dream. I can never. Oh, Mama, why didn't you tell me? You should have told me so we will start looking for solution on time. Who will believe us, man? Who will believe us? That was why I had to run around and get that anointing oil that I gave you. That anointing oil gave you to be applying all over your body. I hope you're still applying it. Yeah, yes, I am. Very good. Once you apply it, no harm will come to you or your baby. Amen. By the grace of God. Amen. Hey! Your Majesty, I am serious. No, I I don't think you are, my dear. I know my son and what he is capable of doing. Queen Mother, I was there. Although he wasn't aware that I was listening to their conversations, when he told my husband that he will be the next king, he told him outrightly that he will be the next king of Ifite. I heard him clearly. Really? Well, I still have my doubts. I, I will talk to my son about it. Meanwhile, thank you very much for coming to inform me. You are welcome, Queen Mother. My pleasure. I am grateful. I'll be taking my leave. Oh, GCK. Oh, go. Oh. Amen. Listen to this public service announcement. The picture on your screen is an unidentified man involved in a ghastly motor accident that claimed his life, which occurred on the 22nd January along Asia Mata Expressway. And all effort to locate his family members since the incident have proved abortive. If you have any information about his family members, please call the number on your screen. How can I help you? I'm calling concerning the photograph displayed on national TV. Do you have any useful information for us? I rather prefer to see you than see you in your life in the kingdom. Of course, it's not far from the city. I'm the queen of the city and I would like to meet you here in my palace. Alright, I'll be there in a jiffy. Sir, 
incident? Yes. Right away, sir. Bombarding my line with calls. I have to put off my phone. We need to be calm. I just called the number on the screen. They are on their way here. They'll be here shortly. Let's go to the big city first. Come with me. My prince, you speak in parables. What exactly are you talking about? to cede the throne to Olisauku. And I know you to be a very confident man who always keeps to his words. But you know that is impossible. Why would you want to cede your throne when you have been named the next heir? You will not understand, or no. I will understand when you have explained things properly to me. You know I'm not the only member of the cabinet. There are others who will never accept this kind of idea. Besides, even if the throne should be given up, you should go to Z, who is also from the royal line. Z has no business with leadership. He's not a good man. I need you to grant my request, you know. It will mean a lot to me. Have you considered the dynasty? It has been in your family for decades. I keep wondering why you want to give up the throne. No king or heir does that while still alive. The dynasty remains. He's only going to be a regent until my son comes of age to take what rightfully belongs to me. Your son? Do you have a son? Yes, I have a son. In due time, you will understand what is going on. you displayed is that of my son 
Can I be cleared? Your Majesty, maybe there was some mix up at the hospital. Excuse me? Did you give birth to a twin and they took one? When I was pregnant with him, my husband, the late king of Ifite Kingdom, insisted on scan to determine the sex of the child. During labor, he was there all through with me. So you can imagine the, the shock I got when I, I saw his picture being displayed on the national news track that he was involved in a ghastly motor accident that took his life? Really? As a matter of fact, my son lives here and dines with us. Your Majesty. Six months ago, we were called to an accident scene. And the man I'm holding his picture here died on the spot. And since then, we've been searching for his family. Where is he presently? At the office. Hold on. Let me put a call to me. <sighs> hey, Jay Jog. A full mom will be How are you, son? Sure, I'm good. Yes. Can I have 30 minutes of your time? Yes. There's an emergency at home. On your way? Perfect. I'm waiting. All right, there. So, dictatives, if your story didn't go well, cause this family an untold emotional trauma. Believe me, I am going to sue the entire police department. Adams from the force headquarters. Excuse me, sir. Did you at any time travel along the Ezamata Express Highway on two? time in there. Let me get. 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 
time in there. People are waiting for you. Baba believes that what he sees is strange. He has called up the dead and the living. They all answered, but he doesn't know what happened. Shumabe. Baba says that ever since he inherited those gifts from his forefathers, he has never seen the kind of thing he sees now. This mirror has been with his family for over a thousand years. He has called your brother a countless time, but he refused to answer. Nabike what? Ghost. Ghost. Amanda, what are you talking about? Ghost what? What are you talking about? Which one is Nabike instead? Madam. Madam, the truth of the matter is that your husband is dead. Died six months ago, and ever since then, I've been looking for his family to come clean with his You all have been living with a ghost all this while. Nothing lasts forever. People come and people go. There's no more time.
Betty, I must commend you for all your commitments to this ugly incident that befell us. On behalf of the royal family and the entire Fita kingdom, I say a big thank you. We will continue to support the Nigerian police, though we are in a money mood right now. Thank you very much. No, we will continue to save and protect. Thank you. Attendant, please, we will come back to pick the remains very soon for proper burial. No problem. No problem. It's all right. How would you feel if you wake up one morning and realize that the person you love so much is no longer there with you? You will never see him again to lay your head on his shoulders and have him by your side. must remain here, alive, to take care of our son and teach him to be a good man, better than his father. Your opinion is as useless as you are. Huh? Yes. You, you, you can never say something good and reasonable. You talk to me like that. Who are you? Look, you better warn your friend. 
You better warn him. He wants to provoke me again. Because you won my friend. Exactly. A fool is better than you. Of course. Yes. Stupid man. You tell me this looking at my eyeballs. Not telling me. Drunks are not here. You are drunk. You quiet. I ah. can handle your case. <clears throat> Oh no. Oh no. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 <clears throat> and according to our tradition, the dynasty remains, thereby putting to an end all the arguments concerning who is to be crowned the next king. <laughs> um, I suggest that we should all go home, then prepare and reassemble in the evening. For us to all proceed to the royal family <laughs> to pay homage to the new prince. Oh no, I claim Even know where to start